Alrighty guys, and welcome back to another LEGO um, mock video from Rick by Brick. And today we have um, Emmett's super smart car, I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean, this mock I made quite a while ago. Like, this was probably a couple months after like I got the free Emmett, Emmett's car mini build at... Um, Toys R Us. So this was like sometime in 2014, probably about a year ago. Um, yeah. So I am kind of disappointed that I actually didn't get to share this with you guys because it is personally one of my favorite remix mocks that I have built. Probably um, Kebab Bob's uh, Kebab Stand is above this one. Um, but I, I don't know, I mean, this is probably my second favorite Remix mock, just because it looks, I don't know, I mean, like, kind of, like it's actually something that maybe you would see in the Lego movie, I don't, I mean, I don't know. Um, you will notice that um, these three pieces up on the top, I mean, don't really serve a purpose, they're just kind of there, because they were the last three pieces. You can take them off, or it actually looks a bit better. Um, kind of looks like a taxi with, uh, you know, a little sign in the middle on the top. So that's why I put that there. Who knows, maybe it's, like, a driving school. That's why there's a steering wheel. But no, we're going to take those off because they just don't really make much sense. Um, I did use, like, 90% 90, 90 of the pieces in the two cars. The only things I didn't use were four wheels, really, because um, in the middle they wouldn't fit. Otherwise, I would have put them there. But, um, you can see we kind of got Emmett sitting in there driving and Larry on the other side. Um, this is a pretty cool mock. I really, really like the way this comes out. Just because it looks kind of, I mean, looks compact, looks pretty cool. You can see it's, I basically took it and put the two smart cars, like, smushed them together. In the middle, um, instead of putting these bricks, I just put the doors, because, you know, I forget exactly why, because it was a while ago, but, um, you know, I guess I probably could have put them in there. Maybe it had something to do with the, uh, minifigure's arms. I don't know. Making room for the arms. And, I mean, it definitely does seem a bit more open if you don't have these in there, because you got, kind of got a little cargo compartment in the center. Which is pretty clever. Um, you'll notice I gave I put a steering wheel on only one side, and on the inside of the windshield I put these two little black pieces, just you know, random dashboard details or something. Um, and it still has the mirrors from the original design of the car, which I actually do like those mirrors. They look pretty good. Um, in the back, I was considering trying, like I was trying to figure out if I should put. Um, you know, put the roof things like this or like this. And um, while this probably looks a little bit better, I just went with, I mean, I don't know. You guys can tell me which thing you look, which uh, you think looks better for the back. But um, the rest of the car looks pretty good. I don't know. I mean, I guess two years ago, I thought it... I mean, not two years ago. One, a year ago, I thought it looked better with the things on the side, just because, you know, it looked more like one open tar. But I actually think this looks kind of better, in a way. Um, maybe it looks better like if you have this up on the top to have them on the outside. I don't know. But, um, no, this looks really good. Um... The one thing I don't like about it is that it didn't really have an even number of, you know, parts to make it really perfect just because the plates weren't, you know, 100% color organized. So it does look a little weird from the back because you got the gray and the white. Uh, I guess I could have put the gray in the center here, but it just looks better as white from the front. And the one thing I don't like about it a ton is the bumper on the front. It would have been really cool if it was a big long one. But um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And have a fantastic day. 
please let me know in the comment section below if you like this mock. I mean, I think it's pretty cool, but that's probably just because I made it. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys all later. Have a fantastic day.